Hey everyone, sorry I've not been in touch, or sorry I've not done an upload in a while. Just brought a pupil down for a test. Whilst I was on the way down here, I did a demo ride for you. So have a look at the demo ride, see what you think, and I'll speak to you soon. And wish Gordon good luck. Good luck, Gordon. Gordon's just passed. Yeah. Okay, if you can hear me, I'm in this lane because the bus lane is out of hours and I'm going to be using the bus lane. So I'm going to be using the bus lane. Look, it's only a bus lane between half seven and half nine and it's now ten o'clock. Okay, here we go. Just let him go. Mirrors. Bus lane, parked car. I am indicating now because of the car behind us. Okay, green man back to red, so my lights will be changing soon. Look ahead before I go in case he stalls. It's probably automatic anyway. Right, looking for any vehicles coming up on the inside of me. No, we're good. Position two is nice. In the middle of all the dangers, we're good taxi on the left with its brake lights on maybe coming out on me check the mirrors and shoulder I'm not going to move over yet because of the oncoming there's people getting in that taxi actually so we're okay red car on the right gray car coming to the junction he might not see me because of the parked car so I'm going to move out to position three cover my brakes just in case watch the pedestrian mirrors Lights may change by the time I get there. Mirrors, off we go. Bus on the left indicating to pull out and there's a bus in front of him so he's going to swing right out. And then he realises the bus in front's moving maybe. Mirrors, going to take lane two at the traffic lights. Carefully pass this bus, watch his front wheels aren't turned out. Yep, pedestrians coming in between the buses. No, we're good. Back brake only. Nice distance behind the car in case he rolls back. Get the revs up because we're going up a hill. Early second gear. Just check to the right. A bit blinding with the sun. Stay away from this bus because of the front end coming out. Look, I'm just allowing for him. Okay, so when we turn right, we obviously need to be over to the right because the vehicle's in the left lane. Early second gear, look at the road surface. Lifesaver in case a cyclist came up while I was focusing on the buses. Stay in the right lane. Road's a bit greasy here, but I've seen a lot worse. Nice early third gear. I'm going to move into lane one. Do I need to indicate? No. If there was a car quite close to me, I would have done. He's braking going down the hill. I'm just using acceleration sense. Lights unlikely to change because they're a pedestrian controlled crossing. Those lights have been green a long time so may change. Check my mirrors. Prepare to stop but give myself a point and no return. Now. If they change I'm going to go. Going straight ahead at the roundabout. Stay in this lane. Mirrors. I like it when that happens, everybody gets out of my way. Just in case they come back again, watch the pedestrian. Nice steady throttle now. Those lights are flashing, so they're going to get a green next. Loads of cars in this lane. If I was on my own, I'd have considered overtaking everybody, but it's not the end of the world staying in this lane now quite dazzly so I'm quite glad I've got my flip down in a visor. Throttle closed, front brake, fitter back, finishing with my gears, off your front brake, back only. First gear now, revs first then clutch. Early second gear, mirrors. Okay I'm just staying back from this van for a second just in case he comes in on me. Okay. It's 
So is that bus braking because he's pulling in or is he just looking at the corner coming up? I'm going to overtake him now. He was just slowing down quite a lot, but be careful his front end might swing out for you. Right, it's a green may change mirrors. That's okay. Lights are changing to red. Check the car next to me. Mirrors, brakes, gears, back brake. And feather off at the end. Looking in my mirrors, if there was a car behind me, I'd have probably flashed my brake lights a couple of times to warn him. Mirrors, shoulders, look ahead before I go. Early second gear, I'm going to get past this van so he can see I'm here basically presented myself to him watch this cycle okay I'm going to move out past the van I don't need to indicate because I'm that far in front of him there's no real benefit I'll leave it to you what you do that's good back into lane one make sure they're not going through on red that van may move in on you so just be careful it seems to be going quite slowly it might be distracted so local knowledge tells me to stay in the right lane, but that bus is going to be turning right. So I'm going to move into lane one just for now. And then after the bus, I'm going to move back out to lane two. But I'll make sure it's safe. That van's coming up at quite a speed. I'm going to let him overtake me first. There we go, look. Because he was shifting. Vans like that tend to tailgate you as well because they're going quick. I'd rather have him in front of me than behind. Okay, lights are green, mirrors still green, point of no return, I'm going to go anyway. Make sure there's no one coming through on red. Mirrors again, silver car just pulling in on the left. Check the mirrors, vehicles braking in front. I can see both the mirrors on the van in front, so I'm a nice safe distance behind him. Watch him, make sure his hands aren't steering that wheel. That's good. I'm going to turn right at the traffic light. So mirrors first, throttle, brakes, gears, brake. Revs first, bit of clutch. Okay, the lights are on red anyway. Just watch these vans don't suddenly realise can we beat the traffic? No. If I was on my own, I would have done, but there's two of us, so. Back brake only. Slightly to the left in the lane. So if that van does use his mirrors, he'll see the mirror of my bike. Just helping you, mate. Nice. Helps you understand what we're looking for, doesn't it? So I am going to indicate right here. And the reason being is the arrow underneath is a straight ahead and a right arrow. So I'm choosing. Okay, that Range Rover wants to come across, look, so it's going to be a delay before we go. So just on this occasion, I'm going to select neutral just to give my hand a rest, keep my front brake on, and keep my right foot down. I'm already stopped. That way when the lights change, I can just pop it into first gear and off I go, rather than all this dancing around with your feet. Ooh, Mr. Angry. So let's try and stay together through these lights if we can. Looking for anybody in the right lane who's going to go straight on and cut me up. So that's where my lifesaver comes in just there. Nice early third gear. He's braking. He might just be habits braking. I'm going to turn left at the lights. Sometimes here I cancel my indicator as well, but look at that oncoming car that's turning. I'm letting him know that I'm also going left, so I'm giving information. Second gear, lifesaver, holding my clutch just in case I need it. Shoulder check, out we go past the parked car. Short right hand bend coming up, check my mirrors before the bend in case I need to slow. Throttle down, I'm happy with the gear I'm in take it round just on the throttle nice and smooth position two mirrors everybody's braking in front mirrors again throttle front brake back brake both together gears back brake revs before clutch 
Oh, oh, can I go with that? Put my feet down. Oh, oh yes. <laughs> going to move into the view of the van in front now so again you can see my bike I've seen people hit reverse before to do a u-turn okay steady throttle now nice and smooth look at the road surface for any diesel spillages and then start rolling the throttle open and feel the bite of the tire on the road van turning mirrors watch his wheels there they go mirrors remember if somebody's close to you it's worth tapping your brake lights a few times before you brake all right this time I'm going to stay in position three presenting myself to the mirror of the van in front it's quite helpful sometimes isn't it listening to people what they're thinking okay lights are on green mirrors and shoulders all good no bicycles there's a silver car coming up on the right he might realise that's a right turn only and cut across in front of me. Watch him. There, that's good. OK, I'm going to move over. I didn't need to indicate on that occasion because there was nobody close. And then this lane will become lane three. Green lights have been on for a while, so they'll probably change. Mirrors, prepare to stop. Brakes, gears, brake. Feather. That's nice, well done mate. That's good for your passengers, it stops them headbutting you at the end. Green man is on. When he turns to red, I've probably got about five seconds. There we go, so let's get the checks in now, nice and early. Look ahead and... Present myself in front of these vehicles in case they need another lane. Hopefully they won't cut me up. Back brake only here revs before clutch second gear stay in lane one watch the cars i'm just watching that silver cars accelerating before i do mirrors it's going to turn by the time we get there it'll be gone but there's a blue car ahead coming out so i'm just going to watch the blue car here it comes if he's got anything about him he'll accelerate positively which he's doing mirrors well done you notice I didn't use my mirrors whilst I was in the danger, I was just watching him. Okay, straight ahead at the roundabout, there are two lanes so we need to maintain ours, but not so far left that we're in gravel. Nobody's catching up with us or overtaking us, that's good. Just enter the roundabout, indicate to exit and then a lifesaver just in case I did miss somebody. Out we come. Safe following distance, position two. Now I'm just wondering whether to change gear or not. No, I'll be fine. See, a lot of cars that tailgate other cars tend to brake a lot because they're not planning ahead. I'm just using my acceleration sense and forward planning and anticipation. Straight ahead at the roundabout, we may as well stay in lane two because local knowledge tells me the bus lane ends, but it starts again. Watch the debris in position two. I've already made my decision, I'm clear to go. Okay, indicate to come off. Left lifesaver, that's where all the traffic would be. Off we go to 40, nice and positive, let's go. I hope you found this helpful. Remember to like, comment and subscribe and I'll speak to you soon. Bye bye.